Because of the popularity of its boy group BTS, Hybe Labels has been the talk of the town. Bang Si Hyuk founded big hit entertainment co LTD, a South Korean global entertainment agency, in 2005. The company also functions as a record label, talent agency, music production company, concert production company, event management company, and music publishing firm. The business has a number of subsidiaries collectively known as Hybe Labels, including Big Hit Music, Source Music, Cletus Entertainment, B-Lift Lab, Cause Entertainment, and Adore. The company signed Lim Jiung Hee in 2012, and together with Source Music, they created the girl group Glam. The group was active until 2014 when it was disbanded as a result of a scandal involving one of the members, Kim Da Hee, who was found guilty of blackmailing actor Lee Byung Hun and given a prison sentence. After that, Hybe abandoned all plans to start new girl groups. However, it appears that the tide has finally turned because New Jeans, a South Korean female group created by Adore, a Hybe Corporation subsidiary, has emerged as the new force in Korean industry. There are five people in the group Minji Honey, Danielle, Tyreen and Hien. Background of New Jeans The double entendre in the group named New Jeans is clever. The name is also a wordplay on the phrase New Jeans, referring to the group ushering in a new generation of pop music. It refers to the fact that jeans are an ageless fashion statement just like the group's intention to carve out a timeless image for themselves. Min Hee Jin, who joined Big Hit Entertainment as CBO in 2019, oversaw the beginning of arrangements for a new girl group to make its debut under the label. Global auditions were held in September and October of 2019, and casting for the group started in January of 2020. Certain group members had already been involved in the entertainment sector before, making their new James debut. But publishing three animated films of the numbers 22, 7, and 22 on their social media platforms on July 1st, 2022, Adore hyped the debut of their new girl group and stoked the rumors that new material would be released on July 22nd. On July 22nd, the group unexpectedly dropped the music video for their first single, Attention, without any advertising or lineup details. Over 1.3 million people watched the video in even less than 24 hours. The group's second single, Hype Boy, was released on July 23rd, along with a 50-second clip revealing the members' identities. Four additional music videos for the song were also included, each focusing on a different member's perspective. On August 4th, the group made their television debut on Mnet's M Countdown, performing all three of the EP's hits. New Jean Members Fans are eager to acquire any fresh details about the highly anticipated female group, New Jean. So, we decided to help the fans by giving them some relief. You'll learn some fascinating details about the New Jean's members. Minji She was formerly a trainee at Source Music. When Minji was in her second year of middle school, she joined Source Music. She represented the 2019 Plus Global Auditions, and she's a participant of the Journaling Club on phoning the app for new jeans. Minji attended Sinsa Middle School and Mansion Elementary School before enrolling in Hanlin Multi Art School. Hani In Melbourne, Victoria, Australia, Hani was born. She is the Hype Beast label's first Vietnamese idol. In addition to Korean and English, Hani also speaks Vietnamese. She was a member of the Melbourne-based dance group Amina Dance Crew. After two and a half years of preparation starting in 2020, Hani passed the big hit global audition in 2019, October. Since nobody knew her name at the time of her appearance in the Permission to Dance music video, fans have named her Cherry. Danielle South Korea's Moonsun Paji Gyeonggi Do is where Danielle was born. She's bilingual in English and Korean. Her mother is Korean and her father is Australian. In Korea, there are only about 20,000 persons with the surname Mo. She belongs to the Hampyong Mo clan, and she started to train in early 2020. Hyrin In Pyeongchang Dongangu, Angyang Yangyo-do, South Korea, Hyrin was born. She is bilingual in English and Korean. Hyrin, also known as the Voice Fairy, used to perform Pansori, 
She attended Pyeongchang Middle School, Seoul Barame Elementary School, and Quinn Elementary School. When she was still in school, Hyrin participated in the broadcasting club. Hyrin's skills is listening and discovering music. She has a practice of spraying perfume before she goes to sleep since the soothing scent relaxes her. Hyun Hyun was born in the South Korean city of Incheon. Under the stage name Yoo Jung, she was formerly a part of the group USSO Girl. When she was 8 years old, she began modeling, and she belongs to EBS Bonnie Honey as well. Her interests include taking walks, searching up movies, and snapping pictures, mainly of the sky and other people. She was featured in Style Magazine Mallow and Lemon Tree Magazine. Her specialties include photographing the group, being completely honest, and discovering what she is constantly looking for. Through the 2014 Jumbo Kids model selection, she was casted. For supporting the Magical Cheom Nom Kid model selection contest, she was awarded. As part of the Play With Me Club, she also made her appearance on the Pocket TV. She's good friends with Kim Riwon from Class Y, BTS, is adored by Hyun, and Hyun attended Wanabi Academy. Is New Jeans a hit or a miss for Hybe labels? The newest girl group to join Hybe, New Jeans, was designed from the start to defy K pop convention. An unorthodox band name, unusual strategies for promotion, Unique musicals address frequently made attempts to nostalgia, and the agency thus far has almost exclusively designed new jeans to position them as a creative underdogs among the newest crop of idol aspirations in the K-pop industry. Starting from the concept photo shoots to their promotional content to making of their music video, New Jeans is on its way to being a popular Y2K-inspired female group, combining 2000s fashion and culture. All five members were born in the early 2000s and have been absorbing inspirations from their childhood experiences and channeling in into their music. The girls adopt kitsch and camp aesthetics into their daily lives, incorporating a quirky color scheme into everything they do. The girls of New Jean, who are all teens, are actively involved in the activity, although many K-pop groups aim to portray Gen Z culture. Regarding the concept of the new girl group, New Jeans, Lee Jin, the CEO of Adore Entertainment, has stated that attention brings not only the quintet's faces to light, but also highlights the group's name, New Jeans. Pop music is a culture that is very close to our daily lives, so it is like the clothes we wear every day. Just as jeans have withstood the test of time and found popularity among many regardless of their age and gender, New Jeans aspires to become an icon of generations. One you never grow tiresome of putting on. Over a million people have already viewed the music video attention by New Jeans. It was the ideal way for the group to present themselves to the viewers because the music video has such a carefree and introductory vibe. With comparably frantic synths and instrumental distortions, Hype Boy raises the tempo, but New Jeans remains committed to making their voices the centerpiece of the mini album. With its tropical touches and futuristic bass, Hype Boy conjures contemporary reimagining of 2000s sounds rather than the slow jam nostalgia of attention. Yet, the way these components are put together creates a dreamy, almost hazy ambiance. The song Hurt acts as a light interlude, a momentary break from the vigor of the songs before it. This soothing song is a leisurely, emotionally driven offering that chooses a steady groove at the risk of being monotonous. Only one note grooves are present and there are no climaxes or dynamic vocal changes. The most contentious track in the mini album is Cookie, an R&B pop tune with a bouncy tempo. Unfortunately, this precise, understated production is accompanied by a lyrical innuendo that when performed by a group of teenagers can only be regarded as worrisome. The debut album by New Jeans is a project with hits and disappointment. However, it would be unreasonable to demand total excellence from a K-pop group that has just made its debut. New Jeans have successfully laid the groundwork for a promising future thanks to their singing skills and the label's audacious artistic vision. Will they be able to gain traction and hone a unique, possibly timeless style as they develop their body of work? That's still up in the air. What are your thoughts on New Jeans? Let's hear them in the comments below and also check out more K-pop Megastars videos by clicking on the next video.